Um, the, the double bogey, double swan neck trailer as we call it. It's not a girder trailer, it's got a, a non-detachable uh, bed to it. Uh, it predates the girder system. And uh, that is now on the move with two of the New Zealand engines. They've got it going at last as the ground's dried out. Um, and you'll see that trundling round now. Uh, and I'm sure that um, we will have several combinations of engines attaching themselves to that uh, uh, that trailer for parades uh, and demonstrations in this arena during the afternoon. Well, we've got a very early Sentinel standing up the top here by the commentary box. You see it's on solid tyres. I think that one was built in Glasgow, but I'm not sure. That's one of the brown babies ones, isn't it, Alan? Come on, now, uh, pay attention. I'd very like that. I was actually looking still at, uh, at the engines on the uh, on the transformer load, so you've caught me unawares there. <laughs> the, only, uh, the only saving grace is I didn't have my mug of tea to my lips the time you asked me the question. Um, I say that yes, one I was think, a brown bale is yeah, And they went, the on, they went on using them right into the 1960s, didn't they? They did, yes. Uh, uh, they were yeah. one of two companies to use early Sentinels. Um, well into the decades after the war, um, the other one being the being the, um, uh, the the Liverpool um, dock. Was, now, was it the um, what, what was the firm called? The one that had tractors on the docks in Liverpool. I can't remember. No, nor I. We we, we both uh, having we my both, age is my excuse. Well, we're both having commentators seen a moment well, at, uh, at, uh, at the same time. It, uh, the Union Box in Africa had something. What was it? Yes, uh, they, they, they definitely the word Africa in their title. Yes. Yeah. It, it'll probably come to me about midnight after yeah, sitting up yeah, in bed. Uh, it'll be a bit yeah. late, but never mind. If, if I think of it earlier, Andrew, when I get home tonight, I'll give you a ring. Oh, um, don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> Oh, a nice barrel there, the governor, or gunner rather, it's uh, Roger Prout's engine. Now that's an interesting engine because it's what we call a single crank compound. So you have two cylinders, uh, but you only have one set of motion and valve gear. And that was a, a barrel idea, and they painted it. And indeed, their speed of buttering engine is coming along as well. Uh, another single crank barrel all the way from New Zealand. Um, and the idea was you had the benefits of compounding, where you had two cylinders and you used the steam twice. Um, but you had the simplicity of the single by just having one lot of valve gear and uh, uh, one big end to look after. <laughs> yes, the objective of compounding was, of course, to increase economy. Um, any, any benefit uh, or bonus of an increase in power is, I think, generally rather secondary to that. Um, because